January 1st of last year, the housing market at an all time high. Some even shelling out half a million over asking. But fast forward 365. January 23 is a whole different world. And the values have actually come down. King County Assessor John Wilson says the market isn't crashing, just leveling off. And what we're seeing across the county is decreases in value from single digits up to the 20% range or so. For example, home values in Queen Anne down 8%. The biggest drop, homes on the east side. Sammamish seeing property values decline 22%. Last year, especially on the east side, it was not unusual for us to see values go up, oh, 30, 35, 40% or more. And that's simply not sustainable economically over a repeated number of years. So what you're seeing is, you know, a market course correction. It does bring good news for homeowners who could see lower property taxes in 2024. The largest factors in your bill are voter approved levies that make up roughly 40%. But if you're looking to buy on the east side, home prices aren't seeing the same drop. The east side is definitely the prices have increased 40% of those homes went over ask. Real estate broker Meg Barlaman says it's likely due to high interest rates and those who locked in at 3% aren't selling. Where we are right now is we have lower inventory. So we have a higher demand, not as much supply, which is why we're seeing the higher prices. Barlaman's advice for home buyers, buy now and refinance when interest rates drop and be patient. What I like to tell people is if they don't get the house that they put an offer in, it goes somewhere else. I go, that just means your house isn't on the market yet. Commercial office buildings also seeing a 15 to 20 percent drop in value, likely due to more people working from home. The King County Assessor's Office expects to sit, finish sending value notices for all 720,000 properties around Labor Day.